Hello Capricorn, welcome to your monthly love reading. We're going to be looking at past, present, and future energies as well as how you feel about one another. As always, it's a general love reading so it will not resonate with every Capricorn watching, you know the drill. Uh, check out the playlist for Capricorn if you want to see more videos. Uh, there might be something there that might resonate for you if this doesn't. So let's just jump right in. Spirit, angels, guides. Messages for Capricorn, please. So the first card out is Distant Horizons, number 36. So you could be um, living at a distance from this person, traveling, going on some sort of um, quest is the word that I just got. I'll look at the booklet for that one. Can I get another one, please? Sarah, tell me more about the connection or what is coming towards Capricorn and love. False person? I don't like that energy. Um, bear with me for a second. I just want to look at the keywords for 36 because in this deck in particular sometimes the cards don't like they have so many meanings. Um, so this card is about hope, dreams, wishes, sailing to a new shore, distant places. With false person, it says that this could be addictions. Interesting. Fantasies, dreams. So it could mean a, a several things. We'll look at the tarot to see. You know, what I'm thinking here is illusion. There might be something here where, you know, a person might have appeared to be too good to be true or there was something that appeared good at first, but maybe wasn't. So we'll see. Let's get into the tarot. Spirit messages for Capricorn, please, for the sign of Capricorn when it comes to love. What does Capricorn need to know? When it comes to love spirit. That's just for I keep seeing the fool. That's just for Capricorn. When it comes to love. Okay, let's cut the deck. Okay, in the distant past we have the five of wands reverse in your energy, the three of swords reverse with Eight of Wands and the what's happening in the present three of cups reverse and the ace of swords reverse yeah okay so deception or verbal conflict could have caused an interference in a connection or there's a third party here some sort of interference here for some reason I think it might be communication um, like something that was said we'll see on their energy, we have the King of Cups reverse and the Lovers, Gemini energy. Okay, I just heard two sides. Two faces? I don't normally get that with the Lovers. Almost like this person, again, they, they presented themselves as something they weren't. Tell me if that's resonating in the comments. In the near future, we have the Tower. Wow some sort of um shocking moment uh a tower falling down something unexpected something big something big is happening here capricorn bottom of the deck the ten of wands and right after that i have the two of cups so this is definitely all about a partnership i feel like there's baggage obstacles obligations burdens and i think it's it's due to one person is what I'm picking up. I was about to put this down, but I'm actually going to clarify with this. Thing. So let's get into this. Now with the five of wands reverse, I don't know. I, typically that card can mean overcoming conflict, right? Winning an argument. Um, so what, we'll see if that's the case. Could it, it could also mean that the fighting and the animosity, the conflict is much worse or isn't is just persisting so we'll see tell me about this five of wands reversed 
Why is the Five of Wands reverse? Why is the Five of Wands reverse? Judgment. Can I get some more information for Capricorn? Why is the Five of Wands reverse? The Sun reverse. Someone has realized something that wasn't clear to them at first. There's been some sort of wake up call here with judgment regarding a conflict or a person. And I feel like someone is almost like defending themselves against this, fighting back, standing firm. Um, I feel like there's a lot of fighting here. I don't know if it's between you and this person or if this is outside of your connection is just affecting your connection, but I feel like there's a lot of fighting here. And someone has had realizations, maybe a realization that they buried deep or that they ignored at first. Tell me about the Three of Cups reverse. What's this Three of Cups reverse? For Capricorn, please, Spirit. What is this Three of Cups reverse? Five of Cups. Regret, disappointment. Seven of Cups. There could have been multiple people involved here. Someone could have made the wrong choice here because I have it with the Five of Cups. There's regrets over a choice. Tell me about the Three of Cups reverse. Yeah. So this is about, um, look at all these cups, by the way. This is like, I feel like someone chose a cup and it wasn't the right cup, right? You see what I'm seeing here? It's almost like they just keep thinking about the wrong choice they made or how unhappy they are with their choice. Some of you are definitely dealing with a situation where there's multiple people involved and it just causes conflict. I have the Five of Swords at the bottom of the deck. Why is the Ace of Swords reverse? Why, why is the Ace of Swords reverse? The Chariot, Cancer Energy. Why is the Ace of Swords reverse? I feel like someone's like walking away from something here. Two of Swords reverse. Spirit, tell me more about this Ace of Swords reverse. Yeah, this is somebody that I feel is choosing themselves. Or they're walking away because they're too good for this or something like that. The Nine of Pentacles. I feel like this might be you, Capricorn. Like you're not going to take any anything less than what you deserve here. You're very successful. I feel like you are very attractive. You have a lot going for you. I don't understand what this is. This could also be that someone... Uh, was deceitful or there was verbal fighting about someone traveling. If this was long distance, there might have been drama surrounding that. Um, this could have been someone lying about being single, secure, stable. Take it as it resonates because I do have a false person here. So I feel like you've been lied to in some way or that has been part of the problem, the communication. All right, Spirit, tell me more about Capricorn's energies. Tell me more. Wow, that one just came right out. True love, love union coming together. The connection between you is genuine and true. Yeah, I feel like this, this was a strong connection at some point. I feel like this had a lot of... Uh, uh, of it was like a, a dream or something that you felt was real but then you know and it could also be that the love is still there maybe you still love this person still despite all that is happening but there's definitely definitely conflict here and i don't think it's going away anytime soon because i have the tower in the near future okay tell me about 
the person that Capricorn is dealing with, Spirit. Tell me about their energies. Tell me about this other person. So Capricorn. Victory lap. Success, recognition, triumph. You're being recognized and admired for your success. Your person wants to be successful at something here. What's at the bottom of the deck? Second chances. Ooh, so I'm looking at this judgment card differently. This could be somebody wanting a second chance with you. Wanting to try again. We'll see. What's that? Seven of swords. Why did he want to come out? <laughs> I don't like that energy. Yeah, look at him. He's just there. Persistent. Hmm. There's somebody around you that you can't trust or has proven themselves to be untrustworthy. Something like that. Tell me about this Three of Swords reverse. Tell me about this Three of Swords reverse. There's the, the, the we have one, two, three, all five, four, four, four fives came out. <laughs> Which at five is the number about challenges, conflict. Uh, tell me more about this three of swords reverse. Yeah, king of swords reverse. There was definitely something here that got in the way. And this is from the past, I feel. Six of cups. Um, this could be a person that got in the way here. Someone, I feel, wants to come back in out of the cold or wants to fix this, possibly. But how, right? The, the communication isn't there or the truth isn't there. You could be very upset at what's happening. Um, once again, I feel like you are... A lot of you are either finding your worth in the middle of this or you will be very soon. Tell me about the Eight of Wands. Why is the Eight of Wands here? Yeah, I feel like you want to either talk about working on this or this person does. Tell me about the Eight of Wands. Another three. Page of Wands reverse, Wheel of Fortune reverse. Interesting. So, okay, Knight of Pentacles reverse. Yeah, there's something off about this. Um, Page of Wands reverse. This is someone that starts things they can't finish. One step forward, three steps back. Someone that has difficulty um, following through. Wheel of Fortune reverse, this is like no progression, bad timing, bad feeling like things are just, it's like the worst luck in the world. So I feel like, you know, you know, it's like someone wanting to work on this, but then it's like the circumstances are not helping with this. So let's see, you could be dealing with a water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. I have Gemini Cancer as well. Tell me about this King of Cups reverse. Why is the King of Cups reverse? Two of Wands reverse, Seven of Cups. Tell me more about this King of Cups reverse. Queen of Swords. So this person is having doubts about actually being successful with whatever they're trying to get done here. I think it's an offer because I have the Ace of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck. Some sort of offer here. But I feel like this is you, King, Queen of Swords. Like maybe you're not going to accept this offer or you're not interested in this offer or you have a very tough exterior. You m might not even trust this person. This person knows that um, this is a long shot, I feel. Tell me about the lovers. I don't know what this two of wands reverse is about. Yeah, six of pentacles reverse. Tell me about the lovers. I feel like there's an imbalance here. One of you is giving more than the other. 
the hermit reverse this is somebody um they immediately thought about someone that runs away um rather than confront the issue virgo energy tell me about the lovers king of wands reverse yeah unfortunately you're you know i hate to say this capricorn but i don't think this person com um follows through with what they say um, this person might lack courage or this person might just be somebody that thinks of themselves, but they don't really think about the consequences of their actions. I feel like they've made a decision here that didn't work out for them. It's like the grass wasn't greener. So let's look at the tower here in the near future. Tell me about the tower. I feel like my cards just don't want to cooperate <laughs> what's this tower about hmm tell me about the tower ace of cups ace of cups ace of pentacles tell me about the tower it's like someone trying to make an offer Ooh, eight of cups interesting I don't know Capricorn I'm picking up I was about to say cancer there some of you are definitely dealing with cancer um I feel like whatever offer this is with the tower you know I'm seeing a few things um the two messages that I'm I'm picking up on the first one is this is someone that's going to surprise you with some sort of offer um or this is going to be an unexpected chance of like love uh, maybe they'll express how much they love you or that they've always loved you or something like that i feel like a lot of you are going to walk away from this offer um perhaps you're walking away because you want true love or um, maybe you're walking away because it's not a good enough offer maybe this person doesn't have a lot to give here or this is you just you've given everything you could give and this this isn't working for you Others of you, I feel like you've already walked away from this person and then there's going to be some sort of love that happens here for you. I hope so. But I think most of you or a lot of you are in the first boat, you know, the first scenario there. I feel like some of you are walking away from a commitment. Yeah, look at this. The Hierophant reverse, Four of Wands reverse, Taurus energy. And focusing on yourself, the star, Aquarius energy, healing, there's the death card, I think it was reverse, yeah, I feel like a lot of you are going to be walking away from what, from a false person, um, tell me if that's resonating in the comments, um, I'd love to hear from you, I feel like they know themselves that this is going to be a tough sell, uh, I think they're still going to try. Um, I think they could have been unfaithful here, unfair to you, but they're still going to try. Uh, and I feel like, I don't know, maybe you've already checked out from this. We'll see, um, if they are going to admit that, <laughs> uh, hit the like button and subscribe. If you enjoyed this reading and want to see more from me, um, I'd love to have you here on the channel. I appreciate everyone who is so kind in the comments and supports the channel. Thank you so much. All right, Capricorn, that is all for today. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you all in another video very soon. Take care.